Technically, no, you cannot get pregnant if your partner ejaculates outside the vagina, but there is a possibility that you can become pregnant if your partner does have some pre-ejaculate on his penis inside your vagina. So just to clarify, a sexual intercourse is between a vagina and a penis. Technically, you cannot get pregnant if you have sex whilst having your period. However, there is a chance that you may have ovulated at a different time, which can cause pregnancy. Yes, you can, as you may have ovulated prior to having sex. Emergency contraception is often referred to as the morning after pill, which implies that sex happened at night and you are having the emergency contraception in the morning after, but sex can happen at any time. So emergency contraception should be taken as soon as possible after you have sex, preferably within the first 72 hours. You are able to get the emergency contraception at any pharmacist across Australia. There is a cost of about $20 to $30. However, you don't need any ID to go and collect the medication. It is preferable that the person that is getting the, going to take the emergency contraception go to the pharmacist as they can educate for future. Emergency contraception can be accessed if you have unprotected sex or the condom breaks or slips um, and you're just unsure whether there was ejaculation or not. That is when to access emergency contraception. No, it should not make it harder for you to get pregnant in the future. However, there are certain types of contraception which can prolong the return of your period, which you can discuss with the GP or nurse. This is a very common misconception and question about breastfeeding and getting pregnant. Yes, you can still get pregnant while breastfeeding, which is why it's important to consider other forms of contraception whilst breastfeeding. This is a very common question we have about termination. However, thoughts are not facts. The fact is that you should be able to have a normal pregnancy in the future after a termination. However, if you are concerned about how this is affecting you, then you are advised to go and see a health professional.